Cut out the elastic casing so that it's three and a half inches wide and 26 inches long. And then go ahead and cut out the main fabric by folding it over and then placing the pattern on it. You want to cut out two pieces of the main fabric. You want to cut out two pieces of the interfacing and then one piece of wadding. After cutting out all your pieces, take the elastic casing, make sure to iron on interfacing on it and make sure it's 26 inches in length. Fold it over as shown and then go ahead and sew it in place. Turn it inside out and then go ahead and cut out elastic that is 13 inches long. Fit the elastic into the elastic casing, making sure to hold it in at the end with pin so it doesn't disappear after doing that this is what it looks like next we want to put the pieces together so grab the pieces making sure the right sides are facing each other and then place the wadding on top now you want to go ahead and pin the elastic on the inside as you can see the elastic casing should be on the inside and you should hold that in pins afterwards you want to go ahead and sew it all around leaving only two inches at the top on sewn go ahead and notch after sewing and then go ahead and turn it inside out so that you're on the right side make sure it's smooth and then go ahead and top stitch it close and that's the end guys